Hi, we're here at the International Film Festival. Um, we are here, and we are talking about the film Sometime Somewhere. Um, so can you tell me a little bit about, tell me who you are first, and then tell me a little bit about your film. Sure, my name is Ricardo Preve. My friends call me Rick. I'm from Argentina. And the film Sometime Somewhere is a documentary about the Hispanic migrant community in the United States, who we are and why we leave our countries, what happens when we get here, and what does the future hold for us. And doing a film that's so real and so personal to you and to people all around the world, um, what kind of feedback did you get from that? Well, uh, migrants and people who are both documented and undocumented migrants who see the film really feel identified with it because many of the uh, participants in the film, many of the characters are migrants themselves, just like I am. And we also got a fair amount of hate mail uh, and people who dislike the premise that we should not be called illegal aliens, we should be called undocumented migrants because uh, migrants are not aliens, uh, they're human beings and they haven't done anything illegal. Absolutely. And did that ever stop you guys from wanting to film or, you know, maybe put a little bit of a damper on the film? No, um, we, I actually spurred us uh, to work even harder to give a voice to those people who are often not able to have a voice. You know, we gave the participants a choice. Do you want us to reveal your identity or not? Some cases they did, some cases they didn't, but they all told amazing stories. And as we were producing the film, it made us see that it was important that we give them an opportunity to speak. And where do we go from here? How do we, you know, what's our next step here? Uh, we got uh, festivals in Brazil, in Uruguay, in Kenya, so in different countries in the world. And uh, I cannot officially announce it yet, but there will be later on in early 2024 a big debate about the film with politicians, with academics and journalists. And uh, we look forward to that debate. Absolutely. And do you see yourself kind of like being a little bit of a voice and a little bit of a, um, I guess, uh, kind of a rebel in this case? Yeah, you know, I didn't seek that role, but I noticed that I can't escape it and that uh, many people depend on me to tell their story. And I think many people say, well, what do you propose, you know? Um, my first step that I propose is education. Find out who these people are, what their dreams, what their hopes are, who they really are. That's the first step towards finding a solution to an immigration issue. And do you feel like you really impacted in this, this film, or do you still have a lot more work to do? I think I'm a small, small part of that, but I'm very proud of the work my team has achieved. And I think we'll make a positive difference into humanizing people who've been criminalized for political purposes. And how can we support you and become a partnership with you guys? You can go to Instagram at Sometime Somewhere Film. That's our page. And you can be updated of everything that we receive, good and bad. Okay. Thank you so much for being here tonight. Thank you. Congratulations on your award. Thank you.